Ugly scenes in Australia as anti-Islam and anti-racism demonstrators clash. There have been injuries and arrests in Melbourne. The venue with most violence on a nationwide day of protest by the Reclaim Australia group, which denounces what it sees as the Islamisation of the country. Demands such as banning the burqa, though, drew an angry response from counter-demonstrators. Police struggled to keep the two sides apart. We're to protest for the rights of everyone to live here. They have an issue with these people that they don't even understand. They just fear them. And as Australians, we're supposed to be a welcoming people. Reclaim Australia denies being racist or anti-Muslim, but for critics, the group's rhetoric and message is provocative. Seven Islamists plan to blow up the Melbourne cricket ground on grand final day. Had they succeeded, they would have killed thousands of men, women and children. One of the men involved had been living in Australia for 19 years on welfare payments. Despite the rain in Sydney, demonstrators were determined to defend what they see as traditional Australian values. Gathering near the cafe where an Islamist gunman staged a deadly siege last December. 